Hello friends, welcome again and this is my new project Leo Management System and I have developed this project in Java, JSP and MySQL. The version for the JDK I am using JDK 1.8. MySQL version is 5.6 and Tomcat version is 7. But if you have Tomcat version 8 and 9, you can easily configure that project on Tomcat version 8 and 9. Right. So this is a web based application. So for front end development, I have used HTML, CSS and JavaScript. Some of the jQuery library also I have used like for form validations, integration of the date calendars and for many more things I have used the jQuery plugins. Also for connecting MySQL with Java JSP, I have used MySQL connector which you will get easily from the mysql.org website. So these all technology stacks I have used for developing this project leave management system. Right. So let's start with the functionality go through that what we have developed, what are the functionalities available inside this project so the project title is live management system and it's a java gsp and mysql web-based mini dbms project mini project because it has only and only admin login dbms project because it can perform different types of database operations web-based because you are running this project on the browser and we have used html css and javascript for developing this project so let's start so if you run this project you will get this home page you can see this is a simple home page and this is a static home page there is nothing dynamic on it this is about us page and it's also a static page and if you want to change that content you can change from about us.gsp this is admin login from here you can log in means admin can log in only right this is a contact us page and it's a static contact us page. I'm not saving the value of this contact us page anywhere into the database. Even I'm not sending any type of email and SMS from this page, right? So once you click on the admin login, it's asking for your credential. So the user ID is admin and the password is test. Once you log inside the system, you will get this dashboard. You can see these are the dashboard, right? Here you can see, uh, so let me check so there is a salary report and uh, leave salary report and add salary these both functionalities are not working because we have not implemented it so don't try it we will remove this menu right so let me go through one by one menu so home page this is the home page this is about page already explained you this is add employee from here admin can add the employee right this is add live from here admin can add the leave information right this is a report from here admin can see the report of all employee right once you click on the edit employee he will be able to edit the employee details right once you click on the view leaves he will be able to see the leaves of all uh, of that employee right once you click on edit he can update the leave status to approve right you can see leave status approved <coughs> right this is a leave report from here admin can see all of the leaves applied which has been applied by <coughs> employees so you can see this is the status of the leaves right once you click on the edit you will be able to update reject means approved or disapproved suppose i am approving it you can see it has been disapproved <coughs> right so these are the leave forms so there are two types of reports here employee report and leave report this is a change password from here admin can change the password right and once he change the password he will be able to log in with his updated password right this is a contact us page which i already explained to you this is a logout once you click on the logout then your session will be destroyed and you will not be able to log in with your sorry you will not be able to access the internal pages right so you can see session has been expired and the above admin menu is not coming but if you log in then admin menus are coming because this is a session driven menu so these all functionalities i have developed inside this project live management system and as i told you earlier this is a java jsp and mysql web-based mini dbms project and if you need the major project of this one then we have also major project available on our website with admin and employee and manager login also right you can watch our video on the youtube channel or on the website so if you need any enhancement in this project just put it into the comments we will incorporate the changes we will make this project more better and better according to your requirements and don't forget to subscribe our channel for getting the latest project videos on the latest technologies 
Thanks for watching the video. Thank you very much.